response, making a PowerPoint slide interactive with questions, and engaging that PowerPoint presentation with response. Next, go ahead and launch your PowerPoint presentation. If you look across the top, and this is Office 2007, you will see an Add-ins tab. Click that. You should see a new line down here for Response, New Question, Edit Question, or Delete Question. This will allow you to easily make each slide interactive that you would like. So if I look at my presentation, I come to a slide where I have already set up a question to be asked. Now what I'm going to do is click on that add-ins tab and I'm now going to select new question. I'm now going to select the format of the question. So it's multiple choice. My options were letters. The number of choices were four. I'm going to give it a point value of one point and I'm now going to select the correct answer. I can set the number of chances the students have to change their answer as well as how much time the students need for that particular question. When I have all of this information set, I click OK. You can now see the little response icon was placed onto that slide. That lets you know that you have created a question going with that slide. Now I'd like to launch my slideshow presentation. You will see this message that comes up that says, we have detected that this presentation contains response questions. Do you want to activate the response session now? Go ahead and click yes. It's now going ahead and launching the Interrate response. Again, I'm just going to go ahead and choose first period. Click OK. Now I'm going to resume my slideshow. At this point, I have my bar at the top. I want to make sure my students join the session before I really progress any further. So what I'm going to do is keep that up there for a second and my students will see that number. They will join the session. Again, you can see that. Now that all the students have joined the session, I'm going to just minimize that bar. I could minimize it all the way down. And I'm just back now at this point, clicking on my PowerPoint, just like I always would. I would do my instruction. And as soon as I get to a slide that has a question, it automatically expands out my toolbar. And again, it floats, allowing me to move it wherever I'd like. The students can now see the question. They can be thinking of their answer. Once I'm ready to begin the timer to allow the students to send their responses, I click on play. The students send their responses. As soon as all the responses are entered, hit stop. You can see my answer distribution. I click close. Click back on the PowerPoint and my bar here will automatically minimize stay out of the way and I just keep clicking and advancing my slides. When I'm finished just click escape and I'm out of my PowerPoint session. I can take this window open it up expand it and end that session click on end the class. That is creating a question in PowerPoint and engaging a PowerPoint presentation in response.